back to Uganda following last week's general election. It has been a politically charged week in the East African nation following last week's elections. And KTN Solomon Serwanja had a one-on-one -on -one interview with political scientist Gerard Karecha on various governance issues in Uganda. Take a look. You're watching Bottom Line East Africa. We're keeping an eye on what's happening here in Uganda. Dr. Kiza Bestige is still detained on what the police has described as preventive arrest at his home in Kasangati. President Jerry Museveni is still warming up to be sworn in as yet again Uganda's president until 2035. There is political unease in Uganda and we want to make sense of it. And joining us in studio tonight is political scholar and political analyst, Dr. Gerard Kariege. Doctor, thank you so much for joining us. Now, Dr. Kiza Besige is still detained and yet he has 10 days to make, uh, you know, a petition to court challenging the results from the recently concluded elections. Is that fair to you? We start with that. No, I don't think it's fair to... Of course, to me, I'm neutral, but to Kiza West, I don't think it's fair to him. <laughs> and also, it's not fair to democracy in this country. Because it's important for Dr. Kiza West to be free to move and express himself. Um, there are suggestions that he's trying to gather evidence uh, to counteract the Electoral Commission, if, that's so, if that is so. So, let it be. So, I think... For purposes of democracy and for growth of acceptance of freedoms, it's helpful that he's more free than restricted. Mm. So it's not fair to him and to the country anyway. Well then, what, what, what should Dr. Kiza Besige do in such a case? Because, I mean, he has tried to say he's going to hold a procession from his home to go to the Electoral Commission to demand for the uh, you know, declaration forms and he has been blocked a number of times. Now, if you try to block someone, then they need to find a way to get out. There is also the other aspect that the intransigence of, of Vesige may, may be a miscalculation. He may think that the population will demand to move with him. But in such circumstances, we should see his agility. The structures, the party should be able to do what he is saying he should do. So, as much as NRM is at test, also the democratic credentials of FDC and its ability as a party to work without individuals, we, to work without this burden that everything is centered around an individual, is uh, being questioned as well. Well, certainly. Doctor, I want to engage you on another presidential candidate who has gone silent. That is former Prime Minister John Patrick Amamambabazi. Unlike Dr. Kiza Besige, who has been all over the media and him trying to uh, make his point to be heard, Amamambabazi seems to be quiet since the results were released. What could be the problem and what is your reading? Is he making a statement by keeping quiet? You know he always keeps us guessing. Yeah, he always keeps us guessing, and maybe we wait for the 10 days. But as we wait, I think his experience through the electoral process, both through the rallies and also the outcome of the, of the result, I think it has dawned on him that he's maybe not as popular as he thought. He couldn't have been the TDA leader as West would have been. And maybe his political career is coming to an end. That's what I would think. What would you think then should be his next move is if he's to remain politically active? In my view, his next move would be to ally with those who think like him and maybe uh, join a, a stronger political party or create one. But given who he is and where he comes from, I suspect that he may have to join Yoweri Museveni again. Is that even possible? It's very possible. He, sh he shines more within than outside the narrative. Wouldn't the opposition then look at this as betrayal? Well, neither has he been largely an ally to the opposition. <laughs> okay, so speaking of which, um, there have, there's been all these efforts to have President Chair Museveni form a unity government.